Hey guys, greetings. How you doing? I hope you're doing well. Welcome to Vinal TV. If you are new to this channel and if you are, please consider subscribing. Thank you very much indeed for stopping by. Thank you very much indeed for clicking. This is HP Dashjet 2723. This printer is multifunctional, multi-tax, triple in one if you like in the sense that you can copy, scan and print from this printer. You keep it simple, essential home printing gear. It uses HP original ink cartridges, 305 black and 305 color. That three color consists of red, blue and yellow. Okay, This printer is dual band, Okay, in the sense that it's can connect it to Wi-Fi okay with self reset and USB port unfortunately this printer the USB port is not included in the pack I got it at home this is the USB port this is the USB cable I'm gonna put up a link how you can get this USB cable from amazon.co.uk or from eBay if you connect this printer via HP Smart App or via Wi-Fi network, you don't need a USB cable. But if you have not got Wi-Fi and want to use hard wire USB cable, this is very handy. Okay. But these days they expect you to use this via your mobile device or via HP Smart App. Okay, so right now. I also want to show you the scanner. Here is the scanner. Okay, and I want to show you some of the features, explain some of the features for you so that you understand. So, this printer you can turn it on and off from this button right here. Okay, and this is LCD screen. Inside this screen, you can see zero. And also see the reception for the Wi-Fi network. Okay, it's very poor right now. But if it's full, it will. Once it's connected, it will full. And also, you can see the ink gauge. You can see the two lines here for the ink cartridges. If you check my video, you see how we connected this printer to ink. The ink cartridges 305. So this is to cancel. If we select any function, maybe select copy. And I want to cancel that job you press here to cancel this is a lot okay and also you can see this blue light is for Wi-Fi network okay it's flashing right now because it's not yet connected and once it's connected this light will no longer be flashing it will be steady blue light on okay and this is a lot this button here is to copy color this button here is to copy black okay so i also want to show you i want to show you right here is the ink cartridges once you open it up it will come right in the middle it does this automatically for you to change it it's using 305 the color goes to the right left and black goes to the right and this printer serial number is right here okay in case if you need to call hp or hp instant give them the serial a serial number and the pin is right here okay that is by the way what i want us to do is to connect this printer to wi-fi network you can see a blue light is flashing here okay so we need to connect this printer to wi-fi network to be able to use it okay so and to do that what we need to do is to go to what we need to do is we need to go to hp smart app okay go to google play okay so if you go to play store okay and inside play store type First of all, before you do this, you make sure that you you turn off your 
mobile data okay and leave only wi-fi network so what i'm doing right now is turning off my mobile data okay and leaving only wi-fi network okay so go to play store and inside play store type hp smart app this is hp smart app download it on your mobile device you can see it's already downloaded on my mobile phone so click it open okay here is the hp smart app what else you need to do is you can see hp smart app bell and plus sign click plus sign it will start searching the available printer right now as you searching this available printer right now what you need to do is to click add printer here we go this is the hp desj 2700 series okay so this printer is found on the app click on the printer that you found right now this is my home wi-fi network is asking us connect printer to wi-fi network so i need to put the password to connect this printer right now so i have my home wi-fi network passport password details which i'm going to put okay Okay, and once you put the pass password, if you're happy with it, okay, what, the next thing you need to do is click continue. Once you click continue, it will ask you to turn on Bluetooth. Bluetooth is required to set up your printer. Click continue. Okay, HP, allow HP Smart App to enable Bluetooth. As you deny or allow, click allow. Now it will turn the Bluetooth on and start connecting. So first of all, you need to find the printer. Printer found. What is doing right now? Preparing the printer. It's preparing the printer. Right now it's asking us to press the flashing information button on the printer. For security, we confine your proximity to the printer. So right now, you can see this information button. Okay. If you look over here, it's asking us to press this information button. You can see information button is flashing on the app as well. It will tell you press the flashing information button. Okay. So we just need to press this once. Okay. And once you press it once, it will it will connect. Okay, so what I'm doing right now is to press this once. Okay, and the, it's no longer flashing. So right now it's preparing the printer. Printer prepared. What it's doing right now is obtaining the IP address. And once, and actually, the Wi-Fi is actually connected because the Wi-Fi is no longer flashing, and this blue light is steady on right now. It's no longer flashing, so it's actually connected. But you need to wait until it finish. Here we go. Printer connected to Wi-Fi network. You can see, printer is connected to Wi-Fi, and I want to show you from here. see printer is connected to Wi-Fi network and also from here you see this steady blue light is on it's no longer flashing and from the mobile device it also tell you the printer is connected to Wi-Fi so you click continue right now it's connecting to HP service beautiful stuff
connected it's tell you connected to HP service click continue if you want to register for the ink service this is where for you to register you create an account if you already have account then you sign in because this is tutorial so I need to skip warranty and account activation skip now it just reminded me do I want to skip yes click skip setup complete okay so right now you can see the setup the Wi-Fi setup is complete so right now you can print okay any document you want this is how to connect this printer to Wi-Fi network thank you very much